The Blairs want to give their kids an experience of a lifetime. Oh, oh, there goes another airplane. And are immersing them in the charming sights and sounds of French village life. So this is the first time we've ever lived anywhere where they celebrate carnival. Just by moving to another continent, you're forced to learn the countries, the geography, and, and forced to learn the language. I think that ends up being a huge advantage. Back on the house hunt, real estate agent Adrian Leeds wants to fit the Blair Bunch under one roof. It has seven bedrooms. But stately homes are maxing out the budget. It's $442,000. And if that weren't enough, more bad news is brewing. The house that we were going to look at next is no longer available. An offer was placed on it. Oh. OK, yes, yes. But the good, the news, good news is I'm waiting. Sorry. that we have another house to look at, but it's not for purchase. It's for long-term rental. Two hours away from Paris, House 3 throws a wrench in the Blair's wish list. But it delivers genuine French country living and surprising treasures around every turn. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my Hello goodness. Again. Wow. <laughs> Have you ever seen a house like this? No wonder you wanted us to see <laughs> yeah. this place. Uh, yeah. This is gorgeous. You're really in the countryside. Yeah, that was a long way from Paris. It's, it's obviously further from Paris than we had originally planned. This is a five-bedroom country house. I'd figure on about $2,000 a month. OK? Renting. All right. I, I know. <laughs> it's not what you want, but it's exceptional. Well, there clearly are some downsides to this particular house because they're not making an investment. Oh, my goodness. So this is fully furnished. I fully mean, we furnished. There's nothing for you to do. It's been completely renovated That's by an artist beautiful. whose house it is. So you'll see his art everywhere. And then you come here, and you've got this huge eat-in kitchen. Oh, wow. <gasps> This is a beautiful kitchen. Aww. Totally modernized, but it still looks really, really charming. So there's another wing. This is the artist's atelier. Are you kidding me? No. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Can't you just imagine the kids sitting here working? Perfect days. It's all here for you to use and enjoy. The... <gasps> Did you see the view? This is the backyard. It's huge. This is really beautiful. It feels so grand walking up this. Yeah, it's majestic, right? Wait till you see this room. Oh, it's so sweet. This bed. Look at this shelf. I mean, every little detail. Here's your master suite. Wow. Oh, my goodness. So this is a wallpaper. No. This is, this is painted. painted. So this artist has just painted every square inch of this house. Just about. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Naked mermaid. Oh, amazing. <laughs> then there's another bedroom oh, here. Oh, I love this bedroom. Oh. It's a pity it's two hours from Paris. Things to think about, right? So I really like it. What do you think? I like it. I think the kids would love this rental. I think the backyard is a huge plus. It's just, it's two hours from Paris instead of one. It's a rental instead of an investment, but it is special. Yeah. So what do you think of this house? <laughs> I'm really glad you showed it to us. I mean, it's, it doesn't meet all our, our list. We couldn't be more rural. I mean, it's, the house doesn't even have a number. It's just got a name. But I'm glad I get to consider it. It's, it's pretty special. Just keep in mind that in this house, you really do have some nice large spaces where the family can gather. It's not quite as sprawling as the other house. It's true. I think for me, it's trying to balance how special is this house and how important were our original hopes and expectations. That means it's going to be a pretty difficult decision for them, because on one hand, it's perfect. On the other hand, it's not perfect at all. They're all great. Coming up. I could see us in any of them. Homeowning has proved a worthy adversary. What's your gut instinct? But the Blairs aren't down for the count. Yes! We're going to lose a friend. <laughs>